buddy. Ooh, this is a little loud. There we go. So, I have not played this game in a while. Actually, let me change because I'm in a voice chat for some reason. Um, let me leave it. There we go. <clears throat> I played the original version of this like the day it came out or got localized to, uh, you know, out here to the US. And I have not, uh, I bought the Royal version a while back, but I haven't played it. And I haven't played this at all in years. So it's almost my first time again. It feels that way at least a little bit. I'm trying to charge the damn iPhone thing on this. What the hell? What the hell am I doing? So I got a... I'm going to let it play out the first time around. And then see... You know, what happens. I don't know where to put the camera yet because I don't remember what the GUI looks like for this game. Um... But I guess I'll figure that out after it starts and I may move where the camera sits. Maybe I should put it a little less opaque or a little more opaque. I'm not sure yet. <clears throat> ah yes, the Spider-Man intro. Now I did read, or actually my girlfriend plays this game a lot. And she told me, what the hell is this? Anyway, my girl did tell me that... It stops re letting you um, record up until... It lets you record or stream through the entire thing, but it blocks it after you hit the royal content, so... And because it's going on YouTube as well, that's why I'm explaining it. But basically, there's going to be... Uh, this series will go up until that royal content, and then I may do videos discussing what's in it, but without showing it, or something like that. I don't know yet, but we'll see what happens. And I think I have a save file that got up to, like, the first week. Um, so it's not really worth it. I'll just start over. And la I played that game through, what, like, a year and a half ago when I visited my girl uh, last summer? I don't remember. Now I'm going to do a rule. I'm not going to use the deals. Oh, there we go. I forgot where the camera was. I am going to do a rule, I'm not going to touch the DLC personas unless I unlock them in normal ways. So I'm not going to summon them and cheat or whatever. Little wine. Uh, I don't understand what this means. CC, are you watching by any chance? Should I click OK or no? I don't know what it means by by reading Persona 5 save data. Is it telling me that if I already started the game I get bonuses? Or is it telling me like... I don't know what the hell this is. What the hell is this? Let's see if CC is watching by any chance. If anybody watching actually knows, oh, I haven't tried it, of course, but I think it gets your benefits. Let me explain. All right, bet. I'm gonna wait a bit. I'm gonna let you try and help me out through this debacle. Debacle, is that a... I feel like I make up words sometimes where I always think that they're for sure words and then somebody hears me say it and then they're like, that's not a word, dude. And I'm like, my bad. I especially get this bad when I read. I've been. Yeah, I'm a reader, and I always have been since a kid. But there's some words where I've read it thousands of times in books, but I've never heard it said out loud. And then I'll say it out loud, and somebody's like, "Are you a dumbass? Like that's not how you say that word." And I'm like, "Well, shit. I've only ever read it, bro. I've never heard it." 
All right, so CC, my girlfriend said, so you know when you finish your game after blood bonding with someone, you get an item from them that unlocks their benefits? I think that's that. that yeah, I don't know what that is. I mean, you told me what that is, but it wasn't in the original, so I don't know what the hell that is. So it's it. I, I guess it's sort of like a way for, if you've already finished the game, let's get you up to the royal part so you don't have to sit there and finish the whole thing. So I'm gonna click no. Uh, experience the game now this one is hard because what is more streamer friendly I personally enjoy the Japanese version but am I going to sit here and read out loud the th hundreds of thousands of lines of text that this game has no my voice will go hurt my voice will grow whorish that's not the word but anyway I'm just going to do English to make it easier for people who may not be watching the video and just listening in. Even though I, Japanese voices are the original, they sound way better, you can't convince me otherwise. Like already that, this story is a work of fiction? Sounds crazy. Anyway. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. My boy Igor. Igor. Looks like the uh, principal. Ew. So I um, I have the chat open on my MacBook and it has the regular drooling sexy emoji that iPhones have. But then the, the PS5 uses this weird like dead-eyed Binding of Isaac looking guy with just water dripping out of his mouth. He looks like he's brain dead. Only those that was who creepy. Have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. I do not agree. Let's end it right here. The contract has been sealed. <sighs> oh man, I feel bad for um The world is not as it should be. Well, it's let's get through this first and then we'll talk. And ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire also change. if anybody's watching who's a persona fan time, they were referred to I've only played persona 3 and all of its DLC persona 4 golden on the P PS Vita and PS uh, I played this to its original ending before the royal like three no more than three it's been what like five years since it came out I was a young thing you but I'm definitely a fan of the whole now series like time to I'm waiting on persona the six of distortion. Um, I'm ready already. They always come out on the newest console, and I got the newest console. Okay, I'm the trickster. I thought I was the fool. Oh, shit. Now, the intro I do remember. Because I, I briefly remember showing this to uh, CC when she, before she even had the game available to her. I went on vacation and I showed her this game, so the intro I definitely remember, and it is badass. Done. This is wine, by the way. Maybe this is why I'm acting like this. Yeah, my boy looking like Batman and like um, Lelouch Lamp Rouge from Code Geass. My man's looking nice. Definitely Batman though. Also, at some point, like coming up and probably during the tutorial, I'm going to have to run outside and get me my... Um, it's a terrifying, no. I am going to have to step out in a little bit and get my, uh, my delicious pork dumplings. And egg rice, egg fried rice. Um, but yeah, 
By the way, CC, since you're probably one of the few people watching right now, what would make this game better? Do you think it's better for me to read out loud every line of text, or should I just expect people to read it and maybe press X slowly? For the ones that aren't narrated. Okay. Yeah, because my voice would get really... How's the volume, my voice, in the game? It's a good combo. Oh, by the way, when this goes up on YouTube, so you guys go check out my gaming channel on YouTube. Um, when this goes up, CC, the one that's commenting in the chat right now, she hand drew the thumbnail I'm going to be using. So, looks beautiful. Appreciate the follow, uh, Ichigo Getsugo. Did I say it right? Almost, right? I, I missed the number, 45. But yeah, she hand drew the thumbnail, so super awesome. Nice work as always, Joker. How's it going, my guy? It's going pretty good for myself, actually. Nice. Oh shit, well, my dumbass. That's from Bleach, ain't it? My boy Ichigo. That's the only Ichigo I know, so maybe I'm wrong. Damn agents. Just run, get out of there. Alright, let's get out through here. Gotta like run through this, man. No Damn, it's been a while since I played this game, but right I'm gonna do my best. Take him down, Joker. <laughs> no, you're fine, dude. I know. I just, I, I remember the last time I played this, and actually any Persona game, and just like you, when I start a Persona game, I get like sucked into it, so I've been kind of avoiding it, because I'm like, it's a whole bunch of a, it's a, it's a big commitment if I start streaming this, because I'm going to not want to stop, <laughs> and I got my day job and shit. Alright. Ooh, you had half an energy drink? I've had... A full one at like 5 p.m. when I probably should not have. Which one did you have? Which one did you try? Oh, I can use with the powers already. Let's do a Brave Blade. So I do remember the, the mechanics of the game, right? If you critical every enemy, you get an all-out attack. Some drink that only has... Was it Red Bull? Rockstar? What color was the cane? You know, when I first played this the very first time... Focus Aid? What the hell? Is it like one of those tiny ones? But yeah, the first time I ever played this game... And I bought this the day it came out. Like, I'm not kidding you guys. I bought the entire PS4, like, and I wasn't making shit money back then. I was in high school working, fa uh, like, fast food. I bought a PS4 in preparation of playing this game because I read that it was only coming out on the PS4. I literally bought an entire console because I was happy with my Xbox just to play this because I had played the uh, Persona 4 Golden on Vita, and I was so excited for the next one. So... Oh, my bad, sorry. <laughs> it's the wine in me, it's making me talk a little more than I should. My man just been standing there. He was getting chased, and then he said, I'm gonna stop for a second. Alright, let's do this shit. I remember, like, getting to this level, too, the first time around. But I don't remember if this exact playthrough was on there. Sorry, this like exact part of the map was in that, or not, that palace. Cause it's been a while, like I said, it's been a while. Huh? What? 
Oh, right, right. My LCD always kicks in when I see the map. I'm like, I have to get everywhere. I don't care if the story tells me I have to come back for it. I will sit there for like 40 minutes trying to figure out how to get there and then be like, fine, I'll go to the next part and then come back later. I do remember though that, because I remember doing the tutorial for Royal. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I did the tutorial for Royal like three years ago. And then I never played it. Um, you, uh, you need to get it, man. Um, do you have the right console for it? Is that, or do you just, you never got around to buying it? Cause dude, I bought it. Like I said, I bought an entire console just to play this game. Like it's a good game. It's a good series. I'll say that. I'll tell you what, man. Definitely worth buying. All right, so if if somebody doesn't know um, the difference, like they've never played Royal in the regular version when it first came out, this right here is brand new. You didn't have no goddamn Toy Story Woody lasso to get around the map. <laughs> so this whole like tutorial sequence is new. Which is cool, I mean... Not only did they add, from what I hear from my girlfriend, not only did they add a ton of time toward the end of the game, but they added, uh, like, new parts to existing maps, which I think is really, really cool. <laughs> Joker, stop! I don't want to stop. I, I'm kind of it kind of sucks that I can't stream the the royal version now I would buy a HDMI yes I can chick see this is all brand new because I remember this right the, the chick jumps in I would buy an HDMI um, capture card Damn, my girl got some, some legs, don't she? <laughs> I'm playing with you, babe. Dude, she got roses. Cece, I'm gonna be Joker, you can be her. Look at that chick. That shit's hilarious, though, isn't it? Like... She just turns back, does this amazing gymnastics move, and then she's like, blah, got the blick in your face. I don't know the backstory at all of her, but that sounds a little bitchy to say. Be like, I relied on you so much, that ends today, bitch. Like, it doesn't sound like she's being supported. It sounds like she's just like, fuck you for helping me. Ooh. It's been a while since we left, but this time it's my turn to come to your aid, Senpai. Now let's win this. All right, my girlfriend has avoided telling me any spoilers, but I'm thinking, bruh, they're they're really good at character writing, but it's still anime. So don't tell me if I'm right, CC, but I'm gonna make the guess right here, live to everybody that may watch this on YouTube in the future. Or the four people watching right now. This is going to be the childhood friend. Like, that's that classic trope where you're like, I forgot that she existed because I'm the main character and then there needs to be drama. And she's going to be like, I've known, I've remembered you since we were kids in the playground or something. I got you guys. I know this. Alright, I don't need to... See, curse damage is so 50-50, man. Because if I recall correctly, a lot of people are immune to it. And then it's got a chance to insta-kill somebody, but it's not very high. But I'll try it out. Fuck it. Nice. Let's do the hold up. 
easy peasy. It is part of the tutorial, but still. Besides uh, the Ice Boy, I don't think I've seen anybody use bright blue before as like one of their colors. I genuinely have no clue what just happened, but I take it you're okay. Hell no, babe! I got rid of him as as soon as he outlived his uh, usefulness. Mm-hmm, Miss Legs. You still have something you need to do as a phantom thief, right? Mm -hmm. Then I won't stop you. Since I I'm just like, who are you, bro? Thieves, the hell? However, please don't forget the promise <laughs> we made. Okay? By the way, um, in case you guys don't know me, you know, you're not gonna know me. I'm gonna make a lot of jokes that sound like I'm picking on the game, but at the end of the day, dude, I absolutely love this game. Hold this whole series holds a special place in my heart, so my jokes are coming from a place of love. They're not tearing the game apart. All right, guys, literally give me 40 seconds. I gotta run outside and grab my food, so I'm not gonna pause the stream because then it's boring to look at a pause stream look. So, one second, guys. You know what I got? Some delicious ass um, pork dumplings is what I said. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. What the hell am I doing? Alright, let's do this. I have to roll my sleeves back for a second. Give me one sec, guys. She do need some food. You see how skinny her legs are? Look at that Persona 5 tattoo right here. That's a joke, by the way. That's not a Persona 5 tattoo. I'm a Persona 5 poser now, aren't I? <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's do this. Was it always pink splats on the ground? I thought it was like red before oh, ho, ho, ho. my boy He's not alone. Find them and kill them all. <laughs> I would love that drawing please give it to me it was all pink splats damn it's been longer than I thought you know what after I finish this game which I may be saying that a little prematurely but once I finish this game, um, and maybe do a couple playthroughs, I'll get a capture card and just stream uh, Persona 4 Golden off my PS Vita. Because that game... That game was what got me started on this series. And then after that, I bought uh, Persona 3 on the PSP, but then I ported it to the PS Vita or some shit. Oh no, I sold my PSP. So I'm gonna have to stream it on like my laptop or something. Yeah, I love this so scene. Reckless, you know that? Don't my boy look badass doing that shit, bro? He was like, I'm jumping out of fucking building, bro. Enemies here? What's wrong? He's reading. It can't be. What happened? 
It's not just enemies, bro. You got the ops, bro. You got 12 in front of you. Look at this. That shit was so clean. My boy said, fuck the ops, bro. Damn. Free my boy Joker, bro. Didn't expect to find some kid. Yeah, honestly though, like this opening really I was already sold on the series, like I said. I played P three and P four before this, but this the this opening legit just was like, oh shit. I don't think that's just you, CC. I think my um, my streaming just my bitrate got a little bit slower. So let me see. Maybe I should. What am I streaming this at? Oh, you know what it is. I'm streaming this at 1080p instead of a uh, 720. It's all right. What about you, Ichigo? Is it loading all right for you, or should I uh, lower the quality? You think? Still don't get it, do you? Give it up. Damn, my boy just got his ass beat. I'm telling you, bro, you can't trust cops. Nowhere. U.S., Japan, nowhere. Anime Japan. Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Hmm. Let me see the exact thingy. All right, he said, "What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence?" Oh, for me getting my ass beat. I'm gonna just be quiet, bro, because I don't talk to no cops. Hear my question? <coughs> Reminds me of America. Destruction of justice. Black he may look white, guys, but remember, he's weapons. Asian. Cops don't like that shit. Slaughter too, yeah. Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. You know what's crazy is at this. I don't remember if they know the extent or not, but if they really just think he's a murderer, there's no damn way you're gonna get away with fucking kicking his ass all over the place. Um, definitely not doing safe. That's super lame. Not doing merciless, so that leaves easy, normal, and hard. I've already played this before, so easy's out of the question. Normal or hard, guys? Y'all decide. It's been a couple years since I played this, but I've beaten Persona 3, Persona 4, and Persona 5, so I'm not new to it. Should I play it on normal or hard? I'll take a little poll. Well, I get my dumplings ready. All right, normal, normal. Oh, I meant normal or hard. Yeah, yeah. You said merciless. You crazy, bro? <laughs> okay. All right. Well, normal it is. We're doing normal. Before I click next, cause I just want to show you guys. Look at this, man. And I'm in the Bay Area, like in California. So the. Uh, the pork dumplings are like legit pork dumplings. They're not like your run-of-the-mill town wannabe Asian place. You know what I mean? This is like legit fucking food. All right, we're doing normal. You should know your place. Damn, bro. You should know your wife's not going to smash if you act this way toward her. I, l I definitely like that they did this, where they incorporated you right in the name of your character into the story. But I'm just thinking, dude, my boy's too badass. He he would be like, fuck you, ops. I'm not doing this shit. So I'm going to just be quiet. I'm going to be like, I'm not talking without my lawyer, bro. I need your hand to sign this, bud. I don't care if you end up losing a leg. I don't care if you got fucking erectile dysfunction, bro. You gotta take it out on me. 
Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. As he fucking punches a miner to death, like he said, take responsibility. Bah. Like, what the hell, dude? <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, you guys already know. Oh, wait, wait. I always forget this. You put your first name and then your last name in this game, or is it last name, first name? Or first or last name first is what I'm asking. Dumplings is like one of the few things I can use chopsticks for. Like, if I try to eat rice with dumplings, ain't happening. It just says sign your name. I bet y'all already know what it is. Wait, I don't have enough letters to write kingpin, do I? K-I-N-G. Oh, yeah, I do. Awesome. Then call me Mr. Kingpin. No, it's not, babe. Given name I thought meant... I thought given name meant um, you got from your parents as in given name is your last name. I don't know. Either way, I'm calling myself Kingpin Light. If they want to call me Light Kingpin, that's on them. Oh, family name. Yep, 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 yep. Kingpin Light. So my family name is Light. <laughs> Mr. Light. There we go. I don't know why I had such a hard time finding that to you guys. I think that wine may have hit me a little harder than I thought. I'm not trying to give you guys some chewing at ASMR, so let me uh, Excuse me, but this area is off. Let me just mute for a second. <laughs> I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? It's called rights, bro. It's my lawyer. Chill. Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, I believe sides. Are you Prosecutor Sai Nijima? I just got off the phone with your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. Mm, I thought I Damn, you bro. to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. She do be looking fine, though, don't she? I will not be convinced unless I'm I can fight for myself. She looks like that power woman that's gonna take control in bed sometimes, and you gotta be like, chill, bro. I don't want to be put into those chains. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you, then. I won't be expecting much, though. Bruh, you know, in today's times, he would get he would get like called sexist for saying that. I don't expect much from you, woman. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> oh, I can do auto. Awesome. I put auto. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. I guess auto doesn't His work. His methods are unknown, after all. We don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> that auto kind of quick, though. 
I didn't expect it'd be you. You'll be answering my questions this time. She said that kind of sexy though, didn't she? Those bastards. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major oh, incident? I was muted. I said, don't don't drop the soap, bro. Anything can happen in here and she can't stop it. I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because bro, I prank. couldn't figure out the method behind it. It's been like half murdering people for however long this game is and you're... Oh, it must be a prank. Crazy ass prank. Damn, I wish I could just keep being quiet the whole game. I'm gonna play my character like he's True. a dick. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you break oh, out about that world? I'm being a dumbass. Earlier I said, I don't know the extent of what they know, but you can't just be beaten on a, a, a minor. But now that I think about it, they caught him in the palace world, so... Obviously, they know a good bit. How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. That's how you know she's never been in love. She's like, how do you steal another person's heart? Well, first you gotta figure out some common ground between y'all and go on a first date. Make sure you pay for everything if you're the guy, blah, blah, blah. Start from the very beginning. <laughs> My boy Igor. You are held captive, a prisoner of fate to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. That's not true. I put normal difficulty. One thing I did miss though playing this game was Marie, or what's her name, Maria. Persona 4, you guys know what I'm talking about. Half a year. I'm trying. Oops. I'm trying to remember. to go I think uh, Persona 6 is already in development but they're notorious at not they literally don't ever leak any information until like a week before release they're like oh hey guys we're done so it's it's coming I know for a fact one of these years because it only took like seven years last time or whatever because they like went bankrupt for a little while or something like that and so the game got put on hold, and then they had to switch console generations. So this should be the longest in between games that we went through. Damn brat! I'll sue. Oh no, he's white. Only white people sue. I love how my boy looks like Ted Bundy sometimes, just this little quiet dude in the background who's actually like a serial murderer. Damn, look at that smooth 15 frames per second action. 
<laughs> I'm kidding, I love this game, like I said. <laughs> if any of you guys have VR games, um, the Oculus VR, there's a visual novel game I bought on there, anime, uh, that I feel like stole this entire scene right here. Tokyo Kronos or something like that. It's clean. Low key, I love the artwork, but doesn't him when he gets his hair up and he's got all those lines when he's angry, doesn't that look like some... Beyblade character. I don't know why that popped in my head, but when I was a kid, I used to watch Beyblade. I when I lived in Mexico in kindergarten, I was like kindergarten age. I lived with my grandma down there, and I used to watch Beyblade in Spanish. And now I can't speak Spanish, so I don't need no hints, bro. Look at my man's hunchback of Notre Dame over here. Notre Dame. Not Trey Dame. I don't know. Let's get the fuck up there. Ah, uh, yes, that's my chick right there. I remember her. She looking fine. Give me that doctor puss. So Jiro Sakura, his house should be in the back streets of the residential area. Yes, sir. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I'm gonna be pretty thorough, even though I've played this game. I'm gonna go ahead and like read a lot of the actions, cause you know, especially for people who may never have played this game, it just makes it more interesting. I don't want to do a speed run, because honestly, if I was playing this without streaming just by myself, I probably would. I don't remember half of it, but I probably would speed run, cause I'll start picking it up as I go. Until I got to the royal content and then I'd slow down, but that's not interesting for anybody, so let's not do that. Hell yeah, I want to listen in. Shut up, old man. Okay, boomer. That's what this was, that's what that phrase was made for. Motherfuckers like that. Oh. You know what's awesome is that you can tell that this game is like a visual novel with an RPG background. Because like this, text log and all that, those are fundamentally uh, visual novel games. I remember this unfriendly officer. I would say never mind, but let's see what he wants to say. Ah. Oh. I thought if I ask him like over and over, he's gonna be like, leave me alone, bitch. I know. I remember like actually taking way too long to find it my first time around. I was like, what back alley, bro? Why is he worried about feeling depressed today when his meeting is tomorrow like chill bro drink a beer you'll be fine this is where the doctor lives right? oh no that's a theater what the hell this guy said he was depressed so he needed to go check out something or whatever this man tried the theater. Of course this man isn't cheered up. What the hell? You tried going to the doctor, bro? Oh. Oh, right, right. Then why is this man chilling by the movie theater, staring at the doctor's office? Why didn't he go by the doctor's office? Stare at the movie theater. Oh, let me talk to that chick. Pet your dog, bro. Was there another, um, ah, accident? I saw a policeman over there. Wait a minute, so she can say the, the word policeman. 
But she can't be saying accident. I bet. Gentle looking mother. You do be looking gentle. Look at you. I want your, your damn dog, bro. Look at him. He looks like that meme dog. He's making like that same meme face. <laughs> Not after ringing the doorbell. Looks like no one's home. <laughs> Mind your business. Oh, yeah. Sakura-san's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, LeBlanc's in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. I wonder if he's talking to himself or he saw me struggling. Because if he just told me where he works, when I'm just, like, stalking outside his house, then that man just, like, real-life stalk- or, uh, real-life docks this man. He was just like, huh? Trying to break into his house, you know where he works. He's never home between 8 p.m. and 6 a.m. That's when you should commit your crime, young man. Hmm? That was my best impersonation of this parcel delivery man, by the way. <clears throat> Alright, where is... There it is. Café Leblanc. Hmm. Really got to think about this option. Yo, low key though. I know it's not part of the story. Wouldn't it be dope if he's one of the old Persona users? Like my boy looks. How frightening! Oh, let me turn auto off for a second. Doesn't my boy Sakura or whatever his name is? Doesn't my boy look like that old man that everybody looks down on the entire series? And then it turns out he's like this super master guy that just doesn't give a shit about showing off. Because he, he looks like a, like an avatar. They have him there. Naruto, they have him there with Jiraiya. Uh, and then an avatar, they have that old firebender guy. That's what he looks like. Like the guy that everybody doesn't look up to at all and then... I don't know where he's like, by the way, guys, I, uh, my power level is over 9,000. What could be going on? Didn't something similar happen just the other day? And down is uh, the name of a shellfish used in pearl farming. See, my man's not even phased by the accidents. He's like, been there, done that. Oh, right. They did say that was today. We'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. <laughs> a what now? There's been a string of those okay, old man. accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. None of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. No wonder my boy's struggling. He's just an asshole to everybody. In his business. Like I'm an asshole to people, but I don't do it in my business. Uh, four hours for just a single cup of joe. So you're the guy. <laughs> so you're the guy. Please take care of me. <laughs> Please take care of me, Daddy. Yeah. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. Have you been told? Sorry guys, I messed that up. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? I and your parents know each other. And, well, not that that matters. Follow me. Matters to me. My parents really just sent me off to a random man. This is your room. They're friends well, with somebody who goes to a cafe store. Cafe or like a coffee shop. 
where the manager looks like a nice dude that would take him in and then the parents are like, fuck yeah, go with him. Hmm? You look fuck like yeah. you want to say something. Yeah, I want to punch your face. Oh. It's big or it's cluttered. <clears throat> Let's put my mind into the situation I'm in to figure out which one I would do. I stopped the rape from happening, basically. I was like, hey, man, don't rape somebody. I got kicked out of school, almost went to jail, got sent out here instead of that. To a man that my parents don't really even know. The guy takes me up to his attic and says, this is your room. Do I say it's big? Or do I say it's cluttered? It do be looking kind of nasty, though. I'm gonna say it's cluttered. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. I'm just trying to smash, bro. Now, Where are the girls at? I got the gist of your situation. I'd be drinking you coffee all night though if I actually worked there. I'd be like, fuck it. I don't he need got sleep. Injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. Yo, don't tell this court about my hometown because everybody had a record there in high school. <laughs> I didn't see no ex expelled shit. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. I love how, like, Japan looks like criminals. Petty criminals. I'm not talking about, like, murders. None of that. I'm talking about, like, stealing, robbing, selling drugs. I love how Japan looks at them like they're the scum of the earth. Like, everybody in high school, or in anybody, if you're not studying, you're the scum of the earth. And then you're in America where, like, again, depending on the crime, but you're selling dope or you're, like stealing cars that type of shit then you're like the coolest dude right like everybody fucks with you i just i find it funny seeing the difference like oh you study in school you nerd motherfucker and then you're in japan and you're like you don't study you weirdo <laughs> anime japan i've never actually been to japan so i don't want to pretend i know their culture but based on this that's called communism or is that socialism I'm on too much wine to talk politically. Let's forget that. <laughs> Look, what are the options? Probation. He's like, behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. I'm like, I'm on probation? What? Nobody told me this, bro. Really now? It's the word that applies to you. Your sentence lasts until next spring, right? No, the word that applies That's to me is fly, motherfucker. Any problems, and you'll be sent straight to juvie. We'll be going to shoot you. <laughs> that was a delicious dinner. <laughs> going where? Shujin Academy, the school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. Thanks. I hate it. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? Well, excuse me, places that won't accept me. I'm just a nice little rape stopper. The fuck? What a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived a little while ago. I brought it up here for you. Sometimes I forget that I'm streaming on like a site. And I feel like me saying the word rape is probably going to get me in trouble somehow, but... Hey, that is what happened, right? The guy was, like, pushing himself up on the girl. What else is it? Got a little dark backstory in this game. Cardboard box. It doesn't that have, like, all the DLC shit. Yeah, it does. I have all the DLC clothes. So it's not cheating that I use the clothes. It's only cheating. Let 
yeah, I could definitely see that because he starts off real tough, but he gave me the the vibe of Persona Four character that took you in the detective, where he was really rough with you, but at the end of the day, he like cared about you. So at first, I was questioning what I thought of Sakura, but over time, like pretty quickly, I realized this motherfucker cares about you. Uh, but like I was saying. It's not cheating for me to use DLC clothes, since there's no benefit to it. So I'm going to do it. But it is cheating if I use the personas given in it. And we're a lot of things on this stream, but cheater, cheating is not one of them. <laughs> Wait, cheater. Cheaters is not... You, you guys know what I mean. Why this man got like 20 gallons of gas just laying around when... I don't think he has a car, bro. He's got a bike. What's this man need 20 gallons of gas for his bike for? I think he does have a car, but still, like, come on. We live in a city, bro. We don't live out in the boonies. Hmm. <laughs> Hold on now, guys. Hold on now. What are those? Is that a big ass, like, uh, a big ass novelty wine bottle? Like, wine glass? What is that? I want that so much. I want that in real life. I'm gonna put that up on my bed stand. Alright, fine. Let's start cleaning. <laughs> a van driver. He strikes me as like ex mafia. I think he kind of is, isn't he? I never, I don't think I ever finished his storyline, but I got like halfway or to the six mark or something, and he was giving me crazy like yakuza vibes. I was like, this man, you gotta watch out for. If, all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. If this was a different anime like show, the way he stands, right? Like he's all hunched over and like relaxed. I would automatically assume this motherfucker's about to kick your face off if you look at him wrong. Like he looks powerful, don't he? Actually, the place doesn't look too bad. It does look nice, don't it, Daddy? It's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? <sighs> Gotta look for the hose, bro. I'm going to close up shop and get out of here myself. I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. Got I that? don't get what the hell that means either. That's like one of those Japanese things. Where they, they act like you're going to get sick from the randomest things. Because... I sleep four hours a day for literally the last two, three years. Like, you can see the bags under my eyes. I ain't even lying. Four hours, and sometimes every other weekend I'll crash for like 14 hours. So I'm not. But I rarely sleep, and I don't think I've ever gotten sick. Like, I very rarely get sick, period. So I don't know where they get this silly idea that staying up till late is going to make you sick. I do remember those sleeping ends your day. Let's change. Let's change into my PJs. I was I did say I was gonna like stream only for an hour a night. But maybe I should stream a little bit longer. Since I've barely got past the the, the, the first tutorial. That's what I'm saying. You're really gonna look and see somebody like pushing himself up on a woman and just be like, it ain't my fault. I'm not trying to go to jail. I'd be like, bruh, you beat your ass. Look at that shit, bro. He sounds creepy as hell. Get in the car. Come on. There's candy in there.
No matter how angry I got at a girl, I wouldn't even use that language. How dare you cross me? I'd be like, bruh, why'd you fuck with me? I probably wouldn't even say that. No! <laughs> Damn. Help! Please stop! See, that don't sound like no... That don't sound not like like no role play. Somebody's like, ow, please stop. I feel like I should go to jail for not stopping. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Look, this means the same things, but you gotta think about the specific wording. I have to save her sounds like Captain Save-A-Ho, right? I can't ignore this is what you need to go with because it's of course you're gonna save her but it's not necessarily like that chick right there looks hot let me go save her it's hey maybe I shouldn't let rape just happen in front of me <laughs> you know what I mean should be the principle of the thing what a waste of time you think you're worth causing me trouble I'll, I'll call the police Call them if you want. The police are my bitches. Damn, They're bro. Take you seriously. He must be white. No! Stop! Someone called the cops, huh? <laughs> uh. Get in the car. Hold on, hold on, hold on, bro. This is what you call a liar right here. This man said the police are my bitches. And then he said, somebody called the cops. Get in the car. What the hell? <laughs> I'd be like, bro, the, the, the cops are obviously aren't your bitches if you're scared of the police sirens. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. You know who speaks like this at bars? Because I've been there. I've gone to a lot of bars in my life. The only people that speak like this at bars... Are people that have zero power or control in their life and they somehow need to be drunk to go telling everybody how they're gonna run the country like do that shit when you're sober and look me in the eyes and then I'll believe you like what are you what are you doing what are you looking at get out of my face <laughs> bro I'm 15 feet away from you chill this ain't a show get lost kid this is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car. I would have beat his ass too, just for looking so bald. That man thinks he's Walter White. <laughs> it's so creepy. Hell no, I ain't a bitch. I like that that uh, phone case he's got though. Those metal. Mm. All right, I love the art in this game, but don't his eyes look way too far apart? He looks like a damn hammerhead shark. I always wondered what would happen, what Igor and all them would say if you just started taking a shit in that toilet. Like, bro, I really gotta go. I didn't even see any toilet paper. They just expect you to sit there and take it. No worries, man. I appreciate you stopping by and talking. Uh, I'm only going to play another, like, 20, 30 minutes. Um, and then I'll probably stream again tomorrow night. So, if you got time, Trickster, stop by. Welcome to my velvet room. Appreciate it, bro. You take care. And I'll be uploading these on YouTube if you ever want to catch up. Currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing 
this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Well then, I am delighted to make your acquaintance. My man's standing straight this as a pole. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. For I summoned sure. you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. <laughs> I'm gonna just I'm gonna just play this like Let me out, bro. I don't give a fuck about your important matters. Know your place, you <laughs> Oh, I forgot Still, that was electrified. This is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. So there's the Truly reason why, babe. This game has him as a prisoner because he feels like no a prisoner. That ruin awaits you. Which now I don't understand why Persona 4's Velvet Room was like a moving car with a bunch of alcohol in it. Did my Persona 4 guy think he was just like living the fast life? He thought he was James Dean. Ruin. I speak of the end to everything. However, there is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be suicide. Rehabilitated, rehabilitated toward freedom. That oh. is your only means to avoid ruin. Only in Japan do, do they think the prison is for rehabilitation. The distortion of the world. Hold on, this isn't this isn't a um, spoiler because it doesn't really matter to the plot. But there is a classic anime scene where they go to like a club or something and they're all like, We're underage, so we're not allowed to drink and then they're like, Go get some uh juice or soda or whatever for us and then he comes back and then halfway through they're talking and they're like, Wait, was that real alcohol? And then they get drunk, so I'm gonna be like, I'd rather avoid ruin, bro. Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Oh, it's empty. Uh, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justine. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like. The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. I wish I was on Japanese though, it sounds so much better. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand. I always wondered if him being up here eventually. If him being up meeting Igor like took away his sleep, because imagine being awake in your dream like this. And then you hear the alarm ringing, and then you wake up. Would you be tired? Like, shit, I got no sleep. Or would you wake up like, ah, refreshed? What does it Looks mean? Like you're up. My boy got swag, though. Tell me that that hat ain't Tommy Hilfiger. I'm going to let y'all just think about that. That's a Tommy Hilfiger hat. Is it not? Hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm doing this for y'all. Look. This is Tommy Hilfiger's, like, color scheme, right? I know it's hard to see, but you should be able to see the colors. That is a Tommy Hill figure hat, bro. Like straight off the well, then, it's going to conveyor belt. To the staff about your transfer. Brand new. It's not even in stores yet. This man is clean with it. Am I wrong or am I right? The school you're attending is in the Aoyama. It'll take a while to get there by train. The transfers are a real hassle, too. And they hate criminals, apparently. I'll drive you there. But just for today, let's go. And my man got the light pastel pink, bro. I'm telling you. 
Exactly, see? You said it at the same time. I love that pastel pink. I had a pastel pink shirt that I used to wear, and I don't know what happened to it, but I used to say revenge on it. It was clean. Same color as that. Exact same color. Exact. Just don't cause me any trouble. I'll try it, Daddy. Bro, look at my hot teacher. You will immediately be expelled. Not this man. The chick looking down. In my opinion, you're nothing but a liability. But we had our circumstances to consider. What? What circumstances? Your damn, uh, no neck having fucking Oompa Loompa head ass. Whatever you might have gotten away with in your hometown, those days are over. Does he not look like the blob? Like the blob meant Professor Xavier? Or, uh, yeah, Professor X, right? Does he not look like Xavier from the X Men mixed with the blob from the mutants? Blob mutant. Hold on, guys. I gotta show you this now. Alright, this isn't like the best picture of him. But tell me this, he doesn't look like the blob, bro. I know I know it's hard to see, but you should be able to tell enough. Like this is this man is the blob, bro. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. Bold of you to assume I want to go anywhere. This is the teacher in charge of your class. She do be looking nice though. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. You gonna get this D. Here's your student ID. Here's your student D. That's what I'm thinking. Damn, she said let me pull that. The school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. All right, Miss Beautiful Eyes. I don't need your help. Promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa. Mm-hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? Bruh, all right, hold on. This beautiful teacher needs to go chill and take that to another room because I don't want to hear you talking shit about me. The fuck? All right, I'm gonna have a little more wine before I can play a little bit longer. By the way, guys, I'm drinking this amazing Ricochet uh, Mendocini County Chardonnay from 2019. This shit do be popping. I am a wine connoisseur ever since I accidentally ordered a wine crate. It is unpopular, babe. She should be looking nice. Perpetual. Yeah, I think it's. So hey, sometimes you gotta get a pouting girl. She'll be like, "Okay, I'll smash." If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? See, my my boy Sajiro came in clutch. He was like, "Can y'all stop talking shit in front of us, bro?" I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well, I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. Damn. Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. Everyone's giving you the cold shoulder. That's what having a criminal record does to you. <laughs> it turns out your past follows you wherever you go. No By shit. Way, if you get expelled now. I won't hesitate to kick you out. Got it? I think I'll scrape by. I could save us all a little time and just kick you out now if that's going to be your attitude. School never changes, huh? I guess. I don't remember school looking like this, but... I'm going home. 
White man got the banana pants, what bro. A he looks situation. clean. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for on this. On me? Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Shut up, rapist man. I remember the him. Principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. Honestly, this first arc, has contributed more than enough to cover I already knew what Persona was capable of with Persona 4, but and Persona 3, which is dark. But anyway, uh, this first arc was definitely like, all right, this isn't just another anime game that does like cliche. You know, I hate my past. Oh, I gotta overcome my. I don't know, bullshit. It was like, oh, they got real serious topics they're talking about. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Why do you hate his eyebrows? They remind you of somebody? Well, I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. Well, I should be returning. Bro, look how short she is. She's like oh, right. two foot the nine. It's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track. Open change. your eyes when you talk, bro. It's creepy. Yes, that's true. Hmm. Why did it have to be my class? Something about having half walls throughout your school bothers uh, me. Like, just leave it open, bro. Not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. So, how was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage? Alright, I'm gonna be nice to my boy Sojiro, because I personally know what it feels like to be stuck in traffic for hours. You don't want to make his day worse. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it seems fun. Do you even understand your situation? All right, my Still, boy. You were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll at a different one. It's not I like got to, bro. Be sympathetic with you. If that's what it was like at school, people might say stuff about me in the future too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. In the future, bro. In the future, you're gonna be dead. You're like 90 years old, bro. I'm gonna just be quiet, bro. I'm gonna let him get his road rage out. I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. And now, back to today's top stories. A subway train has derailed, severely affecting the timetable across all of... Oh, another accident. All right, so I understand it's part of the story where, like, he cut the guy off to talk, but doesn't it sound like the... Like some world ending event just happened and the and the newscaster was like What'd he say exactly? What'd he say? He said across all of and then he got quiet and then he's like, Oh my god, they're here and then aliens start blowing up the city. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. In fact there was a real sad one just last month. It happened before you came here. <laughs> the other ones aren't sad. But this last one, dude, that shit was sad. If I remember right, the girl that passed away was only 15. Ooh. Her parents have got to be just. All traffic around now that I'm 24. Being redirected due to the accident. 15 so does sound like babies. Jam -packed streets. Actually, my little brother, my oldest little brother, is turning 15 in December. So, like. 15 to me sounds like a baby now like oh we gotta protect 15 year olds you know what I mean oh come on no my dad got him a car because he's about to start being able to drive, like about to get his learners at 15. He do be a giant. He's taller than me now, which is a little embarrassing because I thought 5'11 was good. We're experiencing technical difficulties in the lower line. I don't have a visual yet. Direct footage 
damage from the accident. According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. <laughs> this man said, I don't, I don't know, bro. I'm just doing my thing. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently my boy looks like a bean. He looks like he's got a head tumor. Of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will oh, be fuck. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? As Meth. Walter White is loose. That's what you're thinking, correct? Damn, that chick did not even move. Her free? superior would ask her question and she said. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. Bro, she tall like a slim jim. That means her mm, you know her putang. It's tight like a slim jim. <laughs> Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? I do remember his role in the story, and that man do look like a light Yagami, don't he? He looks like a lamer light Yagami, because light Yagami would have kept his cool no matter what when he was pretending to be a good dude. You would have never seen it across his face that, much traffic. that he was ever faced. Waste of time. I wasn't able to open the cafe today. <sighs> Whatever. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. A spanking? Talk about a gruesome accident. Eighty people were involved. Jesus. Oh, I guess that makes sense inside of a train. A I worked on trains, by the way, guys, sure just because of reasons, but. You may be under probation. There's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Can I smoke crack, Sojiro? Is that a special limitation? Besides following the law, that is. Ah, he caught me. I actually didn't know he was going to say that, say that next, so he actually caught me. Damn. However. I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. I'll be like, what if I write my journal? Sojiro sure looks like a great daddy. His body looks amazing. He's got to read that every morning. If I was him, I'd just be like, all right, I'm not reading that anymore. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. I'll see, I'll you, see soon. you soon. See, my boy, uh, Mafia, bro, uh, he's like, I gotta go, bro. Somebody needs a shot in their face. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. You got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? He said, do whatever you want, but go to bed. Be like, bro, I'm like 16, 17, whatever the hell he is. Like, leave me alone. No, you don't, bruh. Only women write down in their journal. Chill. All right, first of all, if you're a guy, I don't care what your thoughts are on the on the gender roles, blah, blah, blah. If you are self-proclaimed a guy, you don't call it a diary. I don't give a shit. It's a journal. You're not writing down anything today in your diary. You're writing it down in your journal, my man. Am I wrong, though? All right. I don't give a shit. <laughs> it's a journal. I'm just saying. 
It's a journal, bro. Alright, baby girl. I think you're probably the only one left. There's, I think, one more person watching. But guys, I think this is where I'm going to end it for tonight. I was just trying to get a feel for how this streaming was going to work for this game. Because... I'll be honest, I didn't even think this was a super streamable game. I thought this was more of a YouTube save game where it's like playthrough. Um, but yeah, guys, I'm going to go ahead and stop it here. And I'll do another one tomorrow, more than likely. Unless something crazy happens in my life. Uh, but make sure to check out my YouTube. I'll be uploading all of my streams onto my gaming YouTube channel. So if you need to catch up on something, go ahead and check that out. But also check out my main YouTube channel where I do reactions to songs and everything else. That might be interesting to you guys if you want to know more about me. Um, but anyway, this was great. You know what I mean? I got some nice people following me and talking. Cece, before I leave, you got anything else to say? About my man standing like... Fucking. Who stands like that? Like Shikamaru? I would smash Sojiro if I, if I was a girl. I'd be smashing Sojiro. And as a guy, I'm only allowed to smash my girl, so I'm not gonna give you an answer on that. Alright. See you guys. I said it like I was about to cancel the stream, but I forgot I'm on the PS5, so it takes a minute. I'll see you guys in a minute. I appreciate everybody watching, by the way.